Good day everybody. Welcome to the Garmin Phoenix 7 Pro tutorial series. In this video, I will assume you know the basic functionality of the watch and know how to access all the relevant menus. If you are unfamiliar with the watch controls, please go to the overview video first. You can either click on the card at the top right or follow the link in the description below. Now on to the topic at hand. From today, we're going to look at the menu items. We are going to do them one at a time, each with its own video. To access the menu, we're going to hold the menu button. We're going to scroll three, through the first three quick options to go to the actual settings. The first one there we've got is activities and apps. If you select that, you will see it brings up all the activities and apps that you have selected and have added to the list of your activities and apps. There's no dividing marker to show you which one is one of your favorites or not. From here, you cannot start an activity, but you can do certain settings on it. So for instance, if we select our walk, we can change the walk settings. So here are all the settings that you need to change for that activity. We go back. We can remove it from our favorites. We can copy the activity. That will mean it will duplicate that activity and it will give it a new name and it will have the exact same settings. So for instance, you'll choose that if you want to separate, let's say, walks that you do um, in the countryside between walks that you do in your suburb. For instance, you want to track some other, some different things or you want some different data screens. You'll copy this activity and then you'll change some settings. So then you will have two activities that is walking and you can name one, for instance, neighborhood walk and you can call the other one felt walking and they will have separate settings if you change that. Then we can reorder it on the list um, where it shows on your activity list. And then we can also remove it from the list. Now, if we were to go to an activity that is not one of our favorites, for instance, let's say I know track me is not. If I select that, we'll have mostly the same settings. So you can go to track me settings, but because it's not one of the favorites here, the option comes on to set it as a favorite. Again, you can copy the activity. You can reorder it on the list, up or down, and you can remove it from the list. So that is the activities and app settings menu.